A lot of people are saying that electric cars are the future for the automotive industry. Uh, the main problem has been battery technology. Um, are there any, what are the promising routes for increasing or decreasing the cost of electric batteries and improving the environmental impact of manufacturing electric cars? Thank you, Brian, that's a great question. This problem that Brian is asking is something that all of us face when we start to go buy an electric car. We can either buy a car that we can afford like a Nissan Leaf, but it doesn't have a whole lot of driving range, or we can get a car that has driving range like the Tesla, but it's very, very expensive. So how do we solve this problem? And this looks even worse when we start looking at gasoline prices because they seem to be dropping every week. But why we would not want to drive a better car that has less environmental pollution, which is what an electric car promises, but the challenge comes down to the cost of the batteries, right? There are two components to a battery cost. One of them is the cost of materials. The second is the cost of taking those materials and making a battery with it, the manufacturing cost. At Berkeley Lab, we've been addressing both those challenges. In the area of materials, we're looking at systems that go beyond the lithium-ion batteries we're using today. Our hope is that these materials will have much lower cost, maybe as much as a factor of two or three lower cost compared to today's lithium-ion systems. And we're making a lot of research headway in trying to get these materials to be successful and commercial. But we're not just stopping there. We are thinking about the bottlenecks in manufacturing, we're thinking hard about where the cost is in the manufacturing of batteries. We're trying to work on those challenges and trying to make these materials into something that will be a low-cost manufacturing process so that we can have an impact on that also, maybe decreasing the cost by a factor of two from the manufacturing side. Ultimately, our hope is that when we bring these two things together, we'll have much lower-cost batteries so that we can buy a car that costs the same as a Nissan Leaf but has the driving range as a Tesla Roadster. That's the hope that we have. While we're doing this, we're also thinking very hard about the environmental impacts, we are thinking about materials in the future that are going to be benign and not toxic so that we don't have an environmental impact on them. We're also thinking about all the problems in the manufacturing space, looking at all the steps where the environment can be impacted and trying to remove those steps in the manufacturing line, hopefully having an impact both on the material side and on the manufacturing side so that we can have an environmentally benign battery in the end of the day. So thank you for the question. That's a great question. Keep them coming and give us feedback at lbl.gov. Thank you.